I'm Jen and finally I'm thrifting in America. Today with Brooklyn Blue. And we're going to this thrift store. Or well, maybe we already went. <laughs> Australia? Yeah. Yeah. It's got like paparazzi over here. Yeah. Don't mind me. I'm not here. Nine one memory? Does the shoe fit? It does. Kind of cute. Oh yeah, it's an 8.5. It probably oh, yeah. fit you better. It's very cute though. That's so cute. And they're like brand new. Nick's loving it at the thrift store. Brooklyn just found me this dress. She's like a thrift queen, so. I gave her all my good stuff. What'd you find there? It's a little leopard dress with a little lettuce hem. I gave Jen the good dress I found. Okay, I'll go investigate. Yeah. Oh, Jen, what'd you find? Typical Arkham dreams. Hi. Aww. <laughs> that is so cute. I know. I like weird dishes. I like that. And yes, we're gonna cut it though. We'll see. Yeah. I think I'm gonna try things on now. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do it. Dressing rooms are closed, so. Hello, Mira. Yep. <laughs> I look like I'm trying to, you know, like, yeah. Y2K with the dress and the jeans. Yeah, that's how it looks. Yours looks good, though. <laughs> Even with the pants. Yeah, well, maybe not with the pants. But it does look good. Yeah. I like this color. Yeah, it's cute. I mean, you could rock it with those pants. Yeah. <laughs> Just throw on docks and you can rock anything, actually. Yeah. Now we have this. Oh, that looks good. Nick doesn't like it when I wear shirts like this, but I don't care about him. Quite cute, but new. No. Nick is in the boyfriend chair. Brooklyn found a top. It's a little vintage t-shirt. Super cute. Kind of reminds me of like the dare, just the colors. Yeah. Black tees are classic. I know. You know? Half price. Yeah. $1.50. What a deal. Red <laughs> Oh, you're, you are doing a video. <laughs> That's, oh, I thought he was like this coming. I'm like, I have no yeah. idea what's happening. That's my rolling, uh, rolling the film in there. Best <laughs> chain of thrift store. Thrift world. Oh, I love that. Good. Are you practicing your safe six? I am. Should I get you both in the shot thrifting? That's actually pretty cool. <laughs> Should I get whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, Should I get can, the first shoes? <laughs> can you practice your safe six, please? <laughs> It's made for kids, but it's like massive. I know, like, we'll be the judge of jacket. who it's made for. Oh, it looks like a fit neck. Oh, that's what I was thinking. It could be cool oversized. Rocking it. Let's do the outfit with black shoes. Yeah. yeah. Should I show me? Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh,
Not my size. Any finds so far? No. I mean, if I was like a little bit smaller, you know. <laughs> totally want Nick to try this on, but he left the store. We'll remember it. We somehow got a lot of stuff. Nick's dead. Do I got again. a green coat, okay? I got a green, I did something too today. <laughs> got a green coat. Yeah. All right, this is all my stuff and I'm probably gonna have to wash it all before I try it on. And this is what Brooklyn got. She got this really cute top. This blue dress and also this really, really cute, I want to say gingham dress, as well as this cute little plate. So yeah, I'm going to wash all the stuff and so is she and then maybe I'll try it on. Alright, time to show you everything I got. There's so much stuff here. And it's a bit of a risk because I'm filming outside, but I thought it was so cute, such a nice day. So yeah, basically meeting Brooklyn, thrifting with Brooklyn was so awesome. And if you want to check out like her channel, her Instagram, I will link it below. But yeah, let's show you what I got quickly because I already know this video is so long because the thrifting portion was like pretty lengthy so <laughs> it was so fun also my boyfriend was helping me shoot he hates thrifting but he pulled through for the whole day so thank you Nick first up what I have is this dress basically as you saw Brooklyn found it for me it's this cool like 90s s dress in a dress dress it'll basically look good with any of my Doc Martens um, I've been wearing it a lot lately with my Mary Jane Docs and I just think it's so cute. Next up, I got these pants, which are indeed, I like thought I was gonna spend most of my six months here in America just trying to find some Levi's that actually fit because they never fit me. But I was looking in the men's section of the, the super thrift, what was it? New Life Thrift, and I found these Levi jeans, they are the 569s, 69, and they're super duper cropped at the bottom, so they're not super long, but guess what? I love cropped jeans, and they're wide leg, and they're super comfy. Like, lately I've found that all my jeans and pants are just super uncomfortable. I, like, once I start eating during the day, I just, like, can't wear them anymore, which is why I, like, resort to wearing dresses. But these jeans, I could wear them anytime and they're so comfy and just like so soft and I kind of get the hype from Levi jeans now. But the thing is they, <laughs> they're not like extremely high waisted. They go like around the belly button, but not over it, which is kind of a flaw, but it's kind of, I guess like low waisted jeans are coming back in. So. We'll see how these go. Basically, I don't know how to wear them with all my cropped tops. I'll just have to start getting a bit longer tops, but I love these jeans and they're the perfect wash. And I think I got them for about $5. So I'm sorry if there's car noises, but just pretend there's heaps of like bird noises, okay? All right, as you saw, we all tried on a lot of jackets. Nick ended up getting that green jacket and I ended up getting this one which you saw which actually i realized like we thought it was synthetic like real crinkly like fake plasticky material but turns out it's actually leather like kind of suede we got this like zebra stripe at the top for a bit of a statement accent so it's not just like a black jacket not boring i can't remember how much it was maybe around like five to seven dollars so this one's really cute then again with the denim it does look pretty much just like those levi's i got this before the levi's during the day and it's this denim skirt now i might have not picked it up if i'd already got those jeans but yeah it's kind of like a longer skirt it's not too tight which i like because i don't like tight things on my legs so yeah it's from ll bean heard that name before but I actually don't know the store and this one was a couple of dollars as well really brings in those like 90s kind of vibes which I like then in that same store 
I picked up this vest, which Brooklyn actually had tried on in a previous time that she'd been to that thrift store, but it actually was just half price that day. So it was like $2. Couldn't say no. It's a little big on me, but the cool part about it, it's reversible. And you know, we all love reversible clothing here. Like, I honestly feel like I should come up with a reversible clothing brand so you don't have to pack so much stuff in your suitcase. I think that would be cool. Like, reversible overalls or something. Yeah, I'm trademarking that. This is the cool vest and it should spice up any kind of outfit. Or if I wanted to go full on like denim on denim, Canadian tuxedo style, I could wear this with any of the denim pieces that I just bought today as well. Then I also got this top, which is kind of this like green that I love in any kind of clothing, but is, yeah, it looks like it was like a grandmother's top. It's got this like star detail and it's kind of slightly gammy, um, see-through kind of thing. And hey, it goes on my clips, see? I love this color so much. So yeah, I got this to kind of put with jeans and like a little crop top and I thought it would give like, I don't know, cool summery vibes even though we're totally going into fall. Side note, this outfit, I love it. It's like, if I lived in Portland, this would be my character. And also at the back, it has like this kind of slit detail. So yeah, it's kind of funky, kind of love it. Kind of was only like a couple of dollars. Ah, the thrifting in America is insane. Like literally there's so many clothes at every single store. Kind of makes sense because it's a bigger population, but I'm gonna be so broke after this trip and I'm not gonna fit anything in my suitcase. Then in the last store, I ended up picking up this in the men's section, which is also like very large. <laughs> it's actually a large Tommy Helfinger um, kind of shirt, which I thought again would look cool on top of jeans and just kind of a laid back look. Also, I thought Nick could borrow it. And yeah, it's just that oversized kind of chill fit. I love the material, I love the colors. So yeah, I got that, but it was a tad expensive. I think it was about $14, which is a little expensive, but I like, I'm so indecisive. I just kind of had to like pull the trigger out. So I was gonna be there for an extra like hour just deciding on that. So I just, I just got it. All right, this last thing is something I actually got in Seattle, but I didn't actually do much thrifting in Seattle, so I thought I'd bump it into this video, and it's this t-shirt, which is so, so cool. I love the color, and I really, really love this detail here. It's just so cool, this nice graphic, and it says Nebraska State Capitol, which is awesome because I was thrifting in Omaha, which is in Nebraska, so it's kind of like my tourist shirt, and I just love the material. So yeah, I got this one at like this really cool store. I can't remember the name of it, but it had like so much cool stuff. And I wish I spent more time in there, but I only had a limited time. So at least luckily I grabbed this and it was $15, which is kind of pricey, but it was more of like a high end kind of thrift antique kind of store. I honestly think that being in Poland is just making me wear Birkenstocks and socks like a hundred percent of the time. Sorry, doc lovers. Anyways, oh, there's a squirrel. Anyways, that is everything that I got while thrifting in Omaha and it was insane. I was so lucky to go with Brooklyn as like my first thrifting expedition and I hope to like meet up with a few more people while I'm here in America to go thrifting. So let me know if there's anyone you think I should go thrifting with. And yeah, that is not the last video that you're gonna see with Brooklyn because I have a whole nother video probably coming out next where she gives me a tattoo. So yeah, we had a fun time hanging out and I got a little tiny vlog of what I did in Nebraska I couldn't fit it into this vlog because it's so long, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't already, please subscribe. My name is Jen, my Instagram is at in the wonder years, and until next time, keep wondering or thrifting anything.